Hello, I'm James Maxlow, CEO of MindTools.com, home to hundreds of free, career-boosting tools and resources. And I'm Amy Carlson from MindTools. When you think about effective leaders, what comes to mind? Chances are you picture someone who listens to their team. They stay cool under pressure. They know when to trust their intuition, and they never let their emotions get the best of them. People like this have a high degree of emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence, or EI, is the ability to recognize your emotions, understand them, and see how they affect those around you. Having high emotional intelligence also means that you see the emotions of others clearly. This allows you to manage your relationships better and avoid potential conflicts. There are five elements that define emotional intelligence. The first is self-awareness. When you're self-aware, you know how you're feeling all of the time and how those feelings are affecting those around you. The second characteristic is self-regulation. This is the ability to control your emotions and actions. You can develop self-regulation by upholding your values and holding yourself accountable when you make a mistake. The next element of emotional intelligence is motivation. Those with high motivation are willing to put off short-term rewards for long-term success. The fourth is empathy. This is when you have an intuitive understanding of other people's emotions and what may be motivating them. Finally, having good social skills is also critically important. If you have strong social skills, then you're more likely to work positively with other people and manage conflict effectively. Having high emotional intelligence is crucial in today's workplace. If you can build and maintain strong relationships, then you can work happily and productively with the people around you. High emotional intelligence is also one of the key attributes of being an effective leader.